All right, guys, welcome to today's sequence. And we're going to be doing a style of class focused around the shoulders. And we're going to begin in a standing position at the top of your mat if you have a mat. So just bringing the feet hip distance apart. And we're just going to start with rolling the shoulder blades on to the back body. So just rolling them back and then rolling the shoulders forward. Dropping the left ear to the left shoulder. You can even extend the right arm out to get in to the right side of the neck a little bit more. And then bringing the head back to neutral, dropping the right ear to the right shoulder. Maybe extending the left palm. And then inhale, reaching the arms out to the side, up overhead. And then exhale, releasing the hands down by the sides, interlacing the fingers behind the back. We're gonna roll the shoulder blades back, keeping the elbows bent, and then extending maybe the arms to straighten, taking a nice bend in the knees and hinging at the hips forward. You can release the head and neck, giving Shaking the head, no. And then bending the right knee, looking over the left shoulder. And then bending the left knee, looking over the right shoulder. Pedaling back and forward, just kind of getting into any areas in the side body, backs of the legs. A few more times. And then releasing the hands down bring the fingers wide inhale halfway lift plant the hands step back into your high plank pose and then lowering the knees down left hand comes just underneath the face we're going to inhale the right arm up to the sky opening across the chest and exhale to thread and hover inhale open extend and exhale, thread and hover. Breathe in, reaching the right fingertips high. And then exhale, the right hand is gonna replace the left hand. Left arm reaches high, breathe in. Exhale to thread and hover. Inhale, open, expand. Exhale, thread and hover. Last one, inhale, opening across the chest and then releasing the left hand coming back to neutral. Tuck the toes and send the hips back into the downward facing dog. Opening up across the shoulders, smooth breath in and exhale, soften. Shifting forward into your high plank, we're going to extend the right arm forward. On the exhale, we're going to reach back for the opposite thigh or the calf. Inhale, reaching forward. Exhale, reaching back to the outer left calf or thigh. Three more. Breathe in. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Looking over the left armpit, breathe in and exhale. Coming back to your high plank position. I'm just going to fix my sweater and then reaching the left hand forward. Left hand comes to the outer right calf or thigh. Inhale, reaching the left arm forward. Try to keep the pelvis neutral. Reaching up behind, maybe looking under the right armpit. Three more. Breathe in. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Breathe in. Exhale. Reaching the left arm forward, releasing the left hand to meet the right high plank pose. Lowering the knees, Chaturanga Dandasana all the way. Keeping the shoulder heads lifted, rolling the shoulders onto the back body, find length. 
through the back of the neck. Pressing into the hands, modified high plank or high plank to downward facing dog. Shift forward, high plank, lower chest, pelvis touches down all together, shoulder heads lifted, and then rolling them on to the back body. Tuck the toes, pressing through your high plank and downward facing dog. Release the knees down and walking the hands just a little bit further, melting the chest forward into puppy pose or heart melting pose. Smooth breath and exhale. Inhale and exhale. And then looking forward, we're going to press into the elbows. So just bringing the shoulders above the elbows. You can interlace the hands or keep them flat onto the ground. Keeping the toes tucked, drawing the navel in towards the spine, lifting up into the dolphin. So you can walk the toes further forward to challenge yourself a little bit more. Just drawing the navel in, pressing the shoulders away, holding in the dolphin. And then release the knees down. Bring the arms by the side. Child's pose. And then bringing the arms back out in front of you, interlacing or not, up to you, tucking the toes. Send the hips back in to the dolphin pose. Maybe lifting the right leg back this time, keeping the hips squared. Releasing the right leg, lifting the left. Hips are staying squared. Release the left leg, holding in the dolphin. Head is lifted. And then releasing the knees down, walking the hands up onto your all fours. Tuck the toes, send the hips back to the downward facing dog. Breathe in and breathe out. Shift forward, high plank, lowering all the way down to the belly and extending the right arm out to the side. High onto the left fingertips, draw the left heel in towards the glute and rolling over onto the right shoulder. Opening up through the front of the right chest. Rolling back on to the belly and switching sides, extending the left arm out long, right heel into the glute, and then rolling on to the left side. Back to center, hands to the low ribs, tuck the toes, pressing through your high plank to downward facing dog. Breathe in, exhale, bend the knees, look forward, step, to the front of the mat. Halfway lift, inhale, and exhale to fold. Anchor to rise, arms reach up overhead, hands to heart center. Breathe in, reach high, exhale to fold. Halfway lift, plant the hands, right leg steps back. Lower the right knee, inhale, reaching the arms up, Grabbing hold of the right wrist, reaching high and arcing over to the left. Breathe in, coming back to center, releasing the right hand down, lifting the right knee, opening up into the twist. Frame the left hand down, release the left hand down to frame the left foot, stepping forward. Halfway lift, breathe in, plant the hands, step the left foot back, release the left knee. Inhale, Anjaneyasana, hugging the right femur bone back, left forward. Grabbing hold of the left wrist, reaching high and arcing to the right. Inhale, center, releasing the left hand down, lifting the left knee and opening the wings. Shoulder blades on the back body as you reach. 
and then touching down with the right hand, high plank through low plank. Shoulder heads lifted, inhale and exhale, send the hips back. Breathe in, exhale, bend the knees, look forward, hop, step to the front, inhale, halfway lift, exhale, fold. Rise to standing, reaching the arms high, and this time exhale to fold. Halfway lift, step the right leg back, keep the right knee lifted, lifting the left arm up, opening across the wingspan. And then from here, pressing into the foundation to lift into the twist. Keep bringing the hands to heart center, facing forward. And then exhale, twist, this time maybe hooking the right elbow on the left knee. Option to open through that wingspan. Coming back up through center, crescent lunge. And then plant the hands high plank through low plank, upward or cobra, and exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe in, bend the knees, look forward, step forward, halfway lift, and exhale to fold. Step the left leg back this time, raising the right arm into the twisted lunge, lifting the torso up into the twisted crescent, and then bringing the hands to heart center, hinging forward and twisting right. Maybe opening up through the wingspan, reaching the right arm sky high, and then lifting into the twist, back to crescent. Plant the hands, high plank, through low plank. Keeping the shoulder heads lifted, inhale, cobra pose, and exhale, downward facing dog. Breathe in, and exhale to stay. Shifting forward, high plank, reaching the right arm forward. Exhale, left right hand to the outer left shin. Reaching forward, exhale, right hand back. Two more times, breathe in, reaching forward, exhale. Last one. Reaching forward, high plank, right away switching sides, left arm reaches forward, left arm back. Four more. Reaching the left arm forward when you finished, planting the left hand back down, high plank through low plank, upward or cobra, and exhale, send the hips back, downward facing dog. Walking the feet to the front of the mat, walking the feet to the hands, inhale, halfway lift, exhale to fold, rise to standing, breathe, and hands to heart center. Reaching the arms high. And then exhale the hands down by the sides, interlacing them behind the back, keeping the elbows bent, rolling the shoulder blades onto the back body, and then hinging at the hips to fold. You can shake out the head, just releasing any bottled up tension in the shoulders. one knee, then bending the other knee. Pedaling out one more each side. And then releasing the hands down, release the seat down, rolling on to the back body, bringing the knees in towards the chest. Smooth inhale. 
and then dropping the knees over to the left. Bringing the hands in either a cactus position, releasing through the belly, smooth inhale, smooth exhale. Bringing the knees back to center and switching sides, dropping the knees over to the right. And back to center, hugging the knees into the chest, squeezing in tight, and then releasing the legs out long and taking a few deep breaths to soften down. Heavy, heavy, heavy. taking as much time as you need here and then rolling over onto one side pressing yourself up into seated no rush no hurry bringing the hands to heart center and thank you for practicing may you find openness the ability to let go Namaste. And if you enjoyed that, please remember to give this video a thumbs up, comment in the comment section below, and subscribe to my channel. And I hope you guys have a lovely rest of the day. Namaste.